So we're here at Giant Stadium, the Temple of Football. After post match, the Revs against the Red Bulls here, Giant Stadium, one one. Okay, a Red Bull fight back. Hey, Red Bull fight back. Uh, you saw Corrales. Please give me your comments. Uh, as I just showed it, it's Steve Nichols. Okay, it's the end of the tunnel. Yes, we go to the dressing room. Okay. the pool room. We look like the desperate team. We look like the team that was fighting for points for playoff position or to make the playoffs okay. in the second half. Oh, yes, I must agree. You know, we even at the end, we were, uh, of course, Mac, uh, could you put that away for me, please? <laughs> I mean, you had a great game. Yeah. I love you, Mac. Yeah. And in another context, if we were actually fighting for playoff position, I'd be pissed yes. at you. But, Mac, you really got to put that away. Uh, great change at the, at the half. He saw that Rojas has to come off. Yes. He saw what we saw. Yes. Unlike Juan Don't Carlos Osorio, who okay. uh, he did not see what we saw. Okay. Hey, uh, uh, again, Richie Wood, somehow he's got them playing. Your take. Okay, well, you know, second half, much better. A moment of magic between Ed Kanji. Dane Richards and John Wallen. Right. Wally Wall puts it away. 1-1, one, one, and I'm thinking, we can win this. And we could have. We could have. Matt Kanji has a one-on-one -on -one against the keeper. A great turn. And a one-on-one -on -one against the keeper. You've got to put that away. Dude. Right. No question. Okay? No question about it. But that's it, you know? That being said. Okay. Although, this continues this like awesome like streak of the refs like either winning or tying us, you know, I think here at Giants Stadium. Right. You know? But what are you going to do? Uh, can you turn the camera on me? I have something to say. Okay. <laughs> at this point, it's not about winning or losing the results. Okay. It's about the style of play and the commitment. Yes. It's a, a more emotional than actual uh, result-oriented football is what, okay. I'm, what I'm worried about. And the emotion and the commitment that I saw from the team, to, if this game was played two months ago, yes. we would have lost 4-5-1. Okay. No, 5-0. Yes. There would have been a total collapse. We would have been down 3-0 at halftime. And there would not have been any kind of fight back. Richie Williams deserves to be the manager. Thank you. Thank you very uh, much. That's it. I really do have to catch the bus. <laughs> One, and by the way, Juan Pablo on hell. I don't know if you saw him. Uh, I did not. Uh, well, wearing a fantastic suit. Oh, well, yeah? His suit costs more than my rent for a month. Well, I hope he's back soon because I, I think Wally's done for the year. He might yes. have broken his leg. I think he's done forever, actually. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest with you. Uh, okay, right, well, thank you very much. Uh, this is uh, Yusuf Corrales, of course, and the Big Viper. And Christian? And Coming to you from... One more thing to say. Okay. The, from our penultimate broadcast yes. from the Temple of Football. The Temple of Football Giants Stadium is right here. We have one more game. Yes. After 30 years of us coming in yes. between different events, you're right. A wrecking ball will destroy this. Destroy place. this perfectly good stadium. Yes. But what are you going to do? <laughs> it's full progress <laughs> in the name of greed. <laughs> All right. So coming to you from Giants Stadium, the Temple of Football. This is Jason Corrales and the Big Viper. Good night. Good night. All right, so I'm here post game with Anna and Steve. Okay, and uh, please, if I can get some post post game commentary from you guys, I it would be appreciated. I'll start it off. Go ahead. Rojas is shit. Oh my God! Shit! Please. Absolute garbage. I would pay for his one way ticket to Venezuela <laughs> right about now. Okay, you know, I mean, horrible. Okay, but you know what? Richie Williams, he knew. And he took him out, and he he, he inserted Salades, and the game turned. Okay, we should have won, but should whatever. Won. I I'll take a point, you know. Better Steve. than a loss. Exactly. Yeah, should have won. I agree. I think Kanji had a wide open shot, which uh, I think anybody should have nailed. Listen, Kanji had a great shot on goal. It's too bad that it was like three or four yards over the yeah. the, the bar, and then at the end he had a one on one situation. That's his bread and butter. I'm sorry. He's got to put that away. It was just, it was embarrassing all of us. Uh, couldn't watch What about Richards? Man, the match, though. Richards? Richards, you didn't see him? He was 
Come on. You know what? He had a great second half. Yes. Not existent in the first half. But what are you going to do? Yeah. You know what? I would give it to Wally. You know? I know. He, he comes through. He comes through. Yeah. At, all the time, you know? He should get a raise. What about that damn ref? Oh, Let's talk God. about the ref. Please. I've never seen Somebody a... Say something about I've never ref. seen a bigger penalty in my life. Yeah. Yeah. And the guy does not call it. What are you going to do? I've seen only one worse ref in the last... In the last yeah. you know, not the great Metro Flip 73 in, joining in us. The past half year, <laughs> yes. I've seen one bad refereeing job worse than tonight. Oh my God, please. And I was in Mexico City to see it. Oh, really? <laughs> Hey. That was one of the worst ones I've seen. But what are you going to do? This was, I mean, come on, please. All right. Well, thank you very much for all your commentary. Coming to you from the Temple of Football Giant <laughs> Stadium. It's right there. Beat one. the Cowboys. <laughs> Beat the Cowboys. All right. Thank you very much. Tony Romo Kago. Tony Romo Kago. I'm, I'm not going to sing the rest of it. But all right. I'm not going to give you your son's Say goodbye, Christian. Bye. Bye.